Hey guys, it's your girl Corey. This video is how to flat iron short hair. I washed my hair um, yesterday morning and I let it um, air dry most of the time and then maybe like five minutes I took a um, blow dryer and went through it. So it's straight but not like, you know, the straight that we want it to be. And I had it in a ponytail so it has like the dent whatever so what I'm gonna be using is in this video is my blow dryer with a comb attached um, and with that we're gonna use it's the smooth shine polishing sleek silk and sleek styling see you can find that at your beauty supply store it's um a straightening butter I put it on my hair before I blow dry and blow dry it in it works magic. And then for the flat iron, we're going to use, I got an FHI. We're going to use that with this um, Hot 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 Curler Thermal Spray by ISO Plus. It's thermal protection, flexible hold, and shine. I love this spray. It works wonders. Like, when you, um, when you do it, it's hard, but when you comb it through, not hard, hard. But when you comb it through, it's just like, BAM! Um, and I got this from Sally's. And a rat tail comb. And then if your hair is dry, I recommend you use some kind of um, thin moisturizer. Like, my hair really gets, not really, but my hair is naturally oily. Not oily, but it's, I don't need to put oil in it, and it's not overly oil. So sometimes I would put this, New Expressions Super Grow. Um, I got this at the Blonde and Brothers Hair Show, but you can get this from um, your beauty supply. It's Super Grow Hair and Scalp Conditioner. And this is very, very thin. Like, just put it on and bam. So stay tuned. We're going to flat iron some short hair. Okay, so I left some out so y'all can see. You want to part it like so. And then comb it. And spray it. Coming through. Take your flat iron. If your roots are like, you know, new growth a little, you just want to do like that on the roots fast, but you're getting to the roots and pulling it. And then take it through. And then take it through. And then. Just finish it off.
hate spraying. <laughs> Like so, make sure you don't, cause you'll get um the lines in your hair. If you have a bang, I suggest you go forward, or you could go back because I'm going to wrap my hair. And then, like, if you was to go out, you just wrap it, and when you're ready to leave, you unwrap it. Let's see. Like so. See? And then you just want to comb it. Like so. And I like to get the edges. Some people are scared to get the edges. But I get the edges. You just go fast over them. I like to use my small one, but that'll be good. See? And just pull it and get the edges real good. Now this side, see how it's like peas, not peas, but you know what I mean. Like so. Some people like to use a hot comb to get through the edges. If you're quick like this, you don't feel the heat. And you get it like that. See? So there you have it. I'm going to take pictures. I'm going to wrap it and then take pictures of it. So there you have it. See? It's way better than before. Okay, so I wrapped it. It's been maybe about an hour, hour and a half. And um, when I take off my scarf, I like to... I forgot which way I twisted it. <laughs> I like to twist it off that way. And then, also, I like to use a clean comb. So every time I wash... Look at that line. Every time I wash my hair... I always clean my brushes, my combs, and my scarf because, you know, you got dirty hair in there. Or it's all greasy, whatever. So when I comb it out, just like to comb it the way that it's wrapped. Now, you could either have your bang. And just style it like that. Or you could part it. Style it like that. You know, but of course, neater. <laughs> you could have your bangs swoop, like comb them down and then hold it. Okay. 
and super coarse like that or you can part it in the middle and just have it like that It's your girl Corey. Peace.